King's Landing is under siege from the forces of the Starks and the Targaryens. And the Golden Company and the Lannisters and the City Watch are here to defend the walls to the last. And there is a lot of them on this wall. Good God, it's going to be hard to break through this. But, uh, I mean, we will see what can certainly be done. I mean, we are attacking today and we are already trying to knock down this wall. And, I mean, this has got a lot of potential getting a lot of good kills here. But uh, we are setting up our first force. We have the Arons here as well. I did forget to mention them. Um, but, yes, they are here today. We are playing with the Seven Kingdoms mod for Attila Total War, uh, which is the Game of Thrones mod on the uh, that is available. But, um, yeah, sadly the replays don't work. I do apologize there is like Steam just appears. Um, but, yeah, so it, sadly the replays don't work. But uh, I've tried it several times, but uh, to no avail. And you can see troops now desperately trying to get off the walls. It looks like they uh, don't really want to have this many troops on the walls. I think, like, the AI just spawned them here. But they do have, like, the Golden Company. They have uh, the Lannisters. I mean, the Golden Company look excellent as well. Uh, and we've got this t the City Watch out here as well somewhere, but uh, I've yet to find them. It looks like we're going to get a free pass onto the walls uh, in some areas. But uh, not all. And there we go. Oh, a huge hole in the wall has been broken up. And we're going to try and get the Dothraki inside now. Um, well, let's get let's get them all inside, please. Uh, and let's also get the un Unsullied up there. Let's get the Unsullied in. I think that's a brilliant idea. And yeah, you can see the Lannisters are trying to get everything off the wall, it would seem. They don't really want to fight here. And, uh, I mean, no surprise. They have... Uh, it's an undefendable pli uh, place. But this is a new King's Landing map. It's... Uh, there is another one, which is like the Blackwater Bay. But this one is a new one. And uh, it looks awesome. This is like the Red Keep over here. The final defense looks amazing. Um, we've got like the Scepter Baylor over there on the, one of the hills. Uh, I think this is supposed to be the Dragon Pit here on another. And then there's like just the rest of the disgusting city beh uh, left behind. So, I mean, yeah, it looks like the Kalazar are getting inside. And they are, well, they're here to, they're here to, for business by the looks of it. They're actually going to make it ahead. <laughs> They're going to make it ahead of the uh, the infantry, which is pretty impressive. But I mean, let's have a look at what's going on down there. Let's see, like the cars. I mean, it's going to be pretty painful for them to fight this out, but uh, they are trying to get in desperately. There's like 200 men in a unit, so I mean, they're going to be pretty damn happy with what's going to happen. And I mean, the Starks are about to reach the wall. I don't think the Arons have yet either. No, they are about to just drop the siege towers. Here they go. The Arons are off the wall, fighting down there against the Lannisters. Here to uh, rid Westeros of its oppressors. And yeah, the Khalzar's in. I mean, they're going to lose a lot of troops. I mean, they've already lost some archers. That's not a bad target to go for. Uh, these guys can just charge down there. Can you land there, please? And you land there. It looks like the towers just all of a sudden, some of them stopped. Decided they'd rather not attack. I mean, that's fine, but that's not what you're paid to do. And we can finally get the unsluted now. I think there's enough room. Alright then, if you don't want to work towers, get off. Just get off your towers. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you can see it Starks now on the walls. I do apologise, there's not going to be as much like close-ups as before in this early bit while we're, while we're fighting it out on the walls. But, uh, I mean, it's not going to need much micro. You can see the Kalzar over here just charged in. That's going to be dangerous as hell. I mean, hopefully they got some good charges off. And they're pretty good in combat, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I mean, they're already routing this golden company here. And the city walls should be ours in time. I mean, the Unsullied are doing their best to hold on. I mean, I think we could probably get some of these irons up onto the wall over here. Quite easily. Oh, they're finding some swords there. 
I mean, yeah, House Iron, I guess. I brought them along because I thought, well, there'd, there'd be some Iron troops that had survived from the Battle of Winterfell. And uh, it'll be interesting to see, like, them here. I mean, you can see the uh, City Gut watching there. The Gold Cloaks doing their bit. I've been re-watching quite a lot of Game of Thrones and I've been uh, thoroughly enjoying it. But look at this mess that's going on in here. This is just horrific. Let's get these archers up here. They could help. Yeah, this is a mess of stuff down here. I mean, you can see gold cloaks. I mean, it's going to be the Kalazar breaking, isn't it? Yeah, most of the Kalazar's broken, which is fair enough. They've done their bit. They've got a fair amount of kills. It's now down to the infantry to do their job. I'm going to get the artillery up nice and close and try and blow some holes in this defense. I mean, most of these uh, golden companies seem to be getting outmatched on the walls here by the Aaron Knights. But what a mess it is up here. Sadly, we can't have dragons flying overhead to uh, just burn burn the defenders. Uh, and sadly, the AI is not clever enough to uh, just charge out its forces and attack us. But uh, Like the Golden Company, for instance. But uh, we, we can do our best. We do our best here on the channel. But if you'd like to see more Game of Thrones on the channel, then do remember to leave a like, subscribe if you're new around here, and a comment to show you support. And also, if you'd like to see any different like scenarios, like I'm always open to different scenarios on Game of Thrones, on like the Seven Kingdoms mod. As you can see, they're unsully trying to battle their way through now. Looks like my uh, Kalazar rejoined the fight. That's okay. We'll have them cap this. Why not? Having them recap that might really help her uh, with morale. I don't know. It might do, it might not. I'm not really sure. Iron can charge off the, uh, the side of the map there, side of the world. Yeah, he's going to be ever so slightly laggy, but that's because it's just a sheer amount of troops on the battlefield. How many men we got on the battlefield? It's not even going to tell me. That's how rude it is. Here we go. 12,000 men. Eh, it shouldn't be that laggy then. Maybe just because there's a lot condensed in this small region here. Which there is. Put this on fire, ammo. Uh, you should probably be charging over here. Good sir. Let's have these, uh, these irons go off the wall. And then we could have, probably should have the rest of the insulated a bit further back, but we don't. But it should be okay. We say. We say it should be okay. I don't know if it will be. Uh, but we've broken most of the stuff here. We're now forcing them back. Yeah, most of the stuff on the wall here is breaking. That's really good. Oh yeah, that's a huge amount of loss. Losses there. I mean, we are slowly capping that. Uh, can you come and cap that as well? Don't know why. I don't think they've lost anything. They've got their general, which is Harry Strickland. This is going to be a good shot with the artillery. Yeah, I decided not to make uh, Jamie the general today because I thought, well... Um, well, basically because he's, he's not really there on their side, is he? He's uh, just trying to find Cersei. Just fire constantly into here. Hit as many of their reserves as possible. So excellent hits going in here, I won't lie. I can see Harry Strickland there. He's got running by on his horse. There is also uh, Gregor Clegane here. So whether it's him, it might be... Let's try and give him a shot. Let's scare him a little bit. Enemy units have been rallied. Oh, that's a good hit. And it's out of ammo. Oh, no, this is the final shot. Oh, God. I don't like that view. Not one bit. Not one bit. But there we go. That should do a lot of damage. The Aaron's now off the wall over there. Can they go down and help fight in the 
in the fight over there. Let's have a look and see what's going on here then. How's Aaron doing its bit? Fighting in the streets. Against the Lannisters. How dare they? All the, the damage they did to the Westeros. How dare they? Um, can you go off the walls here? Should be able to. We might lose a lot until they just stood here, to be honest. They just seem to... Can you just shoot all the way back there? Our siege equipment is lost, our siege equipment's lost eh? Oh, it burnt one of our towers to the ground. What a shame. Um, let's send the crew in for the artillery, because why not? And the, yeah, it looks like we're just about to win on the walls here. We've captured a victory point. Excellent. Um, send up some of these guys. Yeah, we've captured a victory point because, well, we can. I could go after... I might send these guys after the Lannister House Guard. They're just minding their own business back there. Are they find stuff on the wall? I think they are. Wow, this is becoming a bit of a mess, I won't lie. <laughs> this is a mess, but it's a fun mess to watch and fight. And there seems to be all sorts going on down here as well. The city watch are retreating. The an entire unit. They're still fighting here in the choke point of these unsullied as well. Come that way. But yeah, you can attack all the way around here. You can see like the ships over here just like destroyed burning. Like a fleet there that's just off the side burning. I guess it's like if you wanted to use it for like this Blackwater scenario, you can. Um, but I mean, yeah, this is a it's a really, really cool map. Not much else I can say about it really. As I hunt for the, that house guard that's just back here somewhere. I mean, there's so much on the wall, like, of their troops, like, ready for us here. I don't know wh why <laughs> why everything's here. They could have held the walls and done a lot more damage. Uh, there it is. There it is. The men are running, oh. Cowards. Not what I wanted. Did they just break or something? Yeah, they just broke. Wow. They broke as soon as they, like, hit them. It wasn't as good a charge as I was hoped. I, I kind of missed it anyway. But, I mean, we can see what, like, the Dothraki fight it out. The final units of the Dothraki. If you want to see more Dothraki action, I definitely recommend you go and check out the Loot Train uh, video I did. That was a really fun one to watch. Just like hordes of Dothraki and Unsullied just attacking the Lannisters. It was very, very fun to watch. But I mean, yeah, these Dothraki cars are actually winning that fight. And they're now sending us some Golden Company over to come and deal with it. What fools. They won't win that fight. They should never win. Uh, let's send up some more, some more of these guys. And here we go, we've got the Starks in here with their house guards. And their classic Stark. I just love like everything. The shields, it's all got so much detail. But I mean, I mean, yeah, the Lannisters over here are also surrounded. They are. But they're actually having a hard time with the Aaron's house Aaron here. Trying to break through these Lannisters. These spear units here. Just a bloody fight up here. Get off the walls if you can. And here we go. We can finally make a push on this gate. I think our, uh, yeah, our colors are broke eventually. It was just a shame. But it happens. And then you get off there, sir. So. 
Can't seem to just select on some units, but oh well, it looks like it's... I mean, this battle's almost won by the looks of it. We are... We've destroyed half their army. I mean, looks like Harry Strickland's now in combat. I don't know where Gregor Clegane went. And we do have Jon Snow, Jorah Mormont with Grey Worm as our, as our commanders. Yeah, Harry Strickland looks like he's in here somewhere, but I'm not sure where. Can't see his uh, unique... Unique unit, unique model. There he is. Oh, there he is. Deep in enemy lines. He's very bloodied up. He's actually not that deep in enemy lines. Let's just throw in all the unsullied. Throw in the unsullied. Come on. Push them to push them back. But we're now fighting them here as well. We're trying to take the towers. Aaron forces an unsullied fight side by side trying to defeat these uh, Lannisters. Such a, oh and the oil just killing anyone that retreats. I think that's uh, killing yeah Aaron forces here. But it won't be long. I mean the general here if he carries some fighting in combat uh, does Strickland then he's gonna be in danger. He's gonna be in danger. Just need to be careful. You need to go down there and fight. Go down there and fight. Shoot on Strickland. Hit the commander. Because why not? We've got nothing better to do. Actually, shoot them. Our men are rallying. They're not done yet. Get them all up on the wall. Get Grey Worm up onto the wall as well. Iron forces are nearly dead, but I mean, we're not looking great either. We still lost a lot of men of our own. I mean, the Unsullied, they've just been battling to try and get through this single choke point on their own. Poor, poor guys. And there you go, Strickland's running. Strickland is running. I think there's just a couple of volleys. It was just enough to scare him off. And we may have victory, finally. Battling out of this wall. We have, gained the upper hand. we have indeed. As you can see, the Unsullied is celebrating now in this, in the town square here. And there's just a bit of resistance over on this side. This, it looks like the Golden Company is just still holding against the Star Cord. We're burning the city. And the, yeah, the Golden Company. I mean, they, they fought harder in this battle than they did in the, uh, in the series. If you haven't seen it, then I'm sorry for the spoilers there. But the, the enemy's towers have been destroyed. That's going to do a lot of damage to our troops. Enemies are at the wall. Well, that's fine because we're also at the wall. You can see here all these troops now inside. An absolute sea of troops is now inside. Finally, the city will be ours. And we, the enemy general has been killed. Enemy general has been killed. Our Strickland's fallen. Okay. Well, that's certainly going to help. Uh, and finally, I think like, the resistance over here is finally going to give up. The Arons who have fought so hard here. The Knights of the Vale. Finally are going to have victory. And there you go. Victory appears. This is your day. And it is indeed our day. And we will end the battle. And we will end the battle. And we will have a look at the end results. So, uh, yeah, we lost about half of our forces and killed nearly all of theirs. But we did get some really, really good kills. I mean, you can see here, how's Aaron Gar getting 481 kills, 391. Some very insanely good kills there. Archers for the Starks getting 554 kills. Jeez. Uh, one of the Stark... Oh, these are... No, these are the House Guards. Sorry, not the Archers. Um, I do apologize. But yeah, I mean, still getting a lot of kills for the House Guard. Another one getting 375. Uh, the Archers are up here, actually. And they got 125, which is not bad either. Unsullied getting 129 kills, the best one. The uh, Kalazar, the best one getting 88. But I mean, they were poorly, like, 
they just got sent in and they died really uh, it's a bit of a shame and then like the Stark Axemen I think the best one getting 112 so uh, well done to them but yes uh, we'll have a look at the uh, well the defenders I mean they didn't get that many kills I don't think I don't think anything really stood out because it's the AI using it sadly but I mean they like their house guy down here got 64 that's not bad um, but nothing like amazing there really but there are the end result I don't even know where Greg game went but he seemed to just get himself killed really quickly um, but if you enjoyed this defense of King's Landing then please do leave a like subscribe if you're around here and leave a comment and I do hope you guys enjoyed and uh, don't forget to try and we're trying to hit that 2k uh, marker so I, for a face reveal of yours truly and until next time Legionnaires I will see you in the next one